Hi, Richard Rucker, Moyni Osvalios Fasting Detox Retreat Centre in the Algarve. So I'm here with Miriam today. So Miriam's just finished her seven day uh, juice detox. So we're going to find out how it's been. So, how are you? I'm good, I'm good, how are you? Oh, yeah, very good, thanks. Okay, so what attracted you to come here in the first place? Well, I uh, yeah, had a really stressful life in London and I uh, felt like it was all a bit too much and I felt like I felt a bit drained and tired and I just thought I need to change something. So I yeah, actually did some detoxing yes. uh, in London, but it just it didn't last very long, so two days, and then I thought I really had to go and um, and do a proper detox, maybe you know, with um, someone guiding me. Yeah. So I this. Excellent. Mm -hmm. So it's sort of in your mind a little bit. You're aware you're a little bit stressed living in the city. And so what was it that kind of pushed you over the edge into thinking, right, I'm really going to explore it, you know, I'm going to go in a little bit deeper. What was the uh, attraction? Uh, to explore this place, you know. Yeah. Well, the pictures. Yeah, okay, <laughs> well, no, it's good. And seeing all the juices, then that it's all really organised. I don't have to do anything. I just attend when yeah. we get the juice. There are lots of treatments in between. Uh, lots of time to sit on the pool or in the sauna. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, just so that I can just chill out for a whole week and everything else is done for you. That was very <laughs> attractive to me. Okay. Yeah. And what was your first impression when you got here? That it's really nice and calm. Mm -hmm. Lots of space here to walk around. Yeah. And yeah, lots of different options for different treatments. Whatever you feel you mm -hmm. want to do or suits you best or uh, you feel like you can, you can just you know choose from various options, um, which is nice to you know pick things. One day you do have a foot massage, the next day you have another treatment, and then yeah, right. it's really just variety. It's, it's very interesting. Lovely. Yeah. And when you first got here, especially coming from the city, you know your mind was quite busy. I remember we was chatting on the first day or so, you know, and you were like, oh, I want to get this, this, and this done. I mean, how do you contrast your state now to then? You know, did, did you feel, how long did it take it to really drop in? Do you feel, you know, so you weren't on that kind of urban push of trying to get stuff done? Yeah, when I first came here, I was really like, oh, I'm so nice and calm, but I wasn't <laughs> as calm. So it actually took me a while through, you know, different meditation classes and uh, workshops we did mm -hmm. here to really relax. So it, it personally, because I was so stressed and mm -hmm. yeah, because in the city, it's just, I didn't realise how, uh, yeah, meshed up I was inside or mixed up or how do I call it, like, yeah. how immensely stressed I was before. So it took me probably three, four days to really calm down. Yes. Maybe other people would take less time. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, running a business and, and mm -hmm. having various projects on the go, it was just, mm -hmm. so I needed four days and then the last three days were just so relaxing. So I'm, I'm feeling so calm right now. Wonderful, <laughs> wonderful. It's amazing. Yeah. And is everything we've done, has it felt nice and accessible and easy? Is there anything you've struggled with? You know, it's also an interesting question to know. Well, actually, yeah, the relaxing part I struggled with, to okay. be honest. It was yeah. hard to actually really calm down to a level that is yeah. normal. And I didn't realise how high my stress level were. So, yeah. But, um, yeah, it's just nice. You just get different options. You just pick something. And mm -hmm. um, there's always someone who recommends things. So you don't have to think much. You just enjoy from the beginning to the end, which is really nice. So there's... Always lots of stuff around who, you know, if you yeah. feel like because everything comes out, you feel like a bit emotional, there's always someone to talk to, yeah. and very often, they're all very often very encouraging, yeah. which is really nice. So, yeah, if you want to be alone, you just, you know, go into the library and sit and read a book, or are you, yeah. what do you walk? So, yeah. it's just, it's very relaxing, easy, and yeah, and do what you can do what you like, and there. Wonderful. Things to do. So let's run through some of the things that we're doing. So we'll start off maybe with the things we do in the temple. So in the morning we do the yoga, in the evening we do meditation. I don't know how much yoga you've done before, but did the yoga feel okay to you? You know, again, would you think it was suitable yeah. for someone who's not done much yoga? Yeah, I've just done one class in my life before. Okay. <laughs> one single class. Yeah. And I just thought, well, it's, of course, as part of the whole program, I'll just do everything, every class possible. Yeah. Uh, which I did. and. Um, it was such a nice mix, so it's a lot of relaxing in the beginning, mm -hmm. and then very slowly explained how to do it. So yeah. me mixing up left to right, <laughs> yeah. struggling usually with those things. Yeah. Um, yeah, the teachers were very patient, and you know, and uh, the whole group, everyone was so welcoming, nice that it just felt nice, even if you maybe felt a bit, I'm not sure if I can do it, but mm -hmm. it was it was possible to do all the things, and I could feel like I'm 
I can stretch better now and yeah. um, felt flexible, my back feels better. So yeah, wow. classes were yeah. really yeah made for everyone that yeah. you know has to be. It's just a beginner, but for people that were a bit more advanced, they could do stretch a bit more or you know do just keep it a bit keep the position longer. So Excellent. every teacher would really has really looked after the whole group. Great. Right. Individually anyway. So. And what about the nuts and bolts? So that's you know, as well as like the cleansing process, you know, mm. the juices, have you got an okay carry the juices? How have you got on with doing the clismatics? So the clismatics are a process um, that you do where you're putting water through your colon in order to cleanse your colon. I know sometimes people get a bit of a, you know, a bit of a hang up around that. So how have you found that part of it, the different pills you've had to take yeah. as well to cleanse? Well, at first I thought, oh gosh, I'm not going to do this. It's just, I'm not going to, you know, go to the loo and, and yeah. have water coming up there. And <laughs> but it was actually really easy, you know, because they yeah. like this, it was this uh, little booklet in the room which explains everything. Yes. Um, and then everyone else is doing it as well, so it's not that you feel uncomfortable because you're doing this now, it's just everyone mm -hmm. does that and everyone is, that comes actually tries to be part of, mm -hmm. wants to do all the treatments and it was so much easier and so much um, better than I thought and you can actually see results, like things are coming out of you that you would have never thought yes. would ever be in there. Excellent. So I'm really, yeah, I feel so clean and tidy now, which is nice. Lovely. So kinematics was absolutely no problem and um, mm -hmm. yeah, the juices were amazing like it's a nice variety of beetroot and mm -hmm. green juices and um yeah different kind of fruits and so it's really a um, nice variety and i never felt hungry actually i felt at some wow, point i felt really full that i <laughs> had right. only half a juice on one one point because i was yeah i expected to be hungry all the time fasting but yeah because of everything how it all made mm -hmm. you and, and the program is made it's just you you actually feel mm -hmm. not hungry one single minute wow that's wonderful so that's good and obviously we also try and work a little bit with your inner levels, you know, we do the education workshops in the evening, through some of the yoga as well, we're trying to encourage, you know, or, or allow you to access and open some of your own levels of creativity, and obviously we did a little ceremony last night about visioning. So have you found you've had plenty of time to work on those inner levels of yourself? Not necessarily work on them, but just that have evolved and moved through the process as well. Oh yeah, big time. Oh yeah? I, I knew that I kind of, you know, had a lot of stuff going on inside me that I couldn't really understand or wanted to get out or you know there are different things that I really felt I need to work on and now I really am absolutely really clear about everything mm -hmm. why I'm doing things I was doing in the past and okay. what upset me why I'm hurt why I was hurt mm -hmm. um, so it had a huge huge impact yeah I feel I got lots of answers for myself now as well, which is very really mm -hmm. nice. But of course, the whole process was a bit emotional as well, where when you find out suddenly why, you know, you yes. have fears or problems or um, react in certain ways in, in your mm -hmm. normal life, um, when you find out here actually why that is, because you do so much soul searching and, and um, yes. meditation and you really go really deep inside yourself and, uh -huh. and find out what's, what's inside that, that makes you so upset. So that's quite um, impressive to find out, but it's also mm -hmm. very emotional, so I've shed quite a few tears. Okay, okay. <laughs> but um, yeah, I know now, you know, what I have to work on, so mm -hmm. it's, I'm really excited about the future. So with that then, you know, like you're going into a bit of an emotional process, there's obviously lots of different therapies here as well, so did you feel, you know, supported at all times with that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's okay. even having a foot massage, yeah. um, and I was talking and... The lady who was giving me foot massage could even sense things that I mm -hmm. would go on inside me and, and gave me some advice and, and talked me through a few things. So yeah. and then when I felt upset, you know, there was always someone to, you know, to mm -hmm. talk with and yes. Wonderful. Great. And you got an okay with the other therapist and I got a bit of acupuncture as well, some massage, mm -hmm. the physio aspect, it all went fine for you, did it as well? Yeah, physio bits were great. Acupuncture yeah. was really good, I had two sessions. Yeah. Uh, foot massages, um, mm -hmm. I used the Napa. Nice. Five dots, which is yeah. there were plenty around, but I could always use one. Yeah. Um, the magnetic bed, yeah. um, sauna. Wow. <laughs> meditation, yeah. and yoga. Happiness. So it's yeah, yeah. There was was lots of different treatments I did, and great. I, I'm trying to do as much as possible. Okay. <laughs> and through sex as well. Yeah. Lovely. So, if someone's out there and they're teething on the brink of coming, you know, what kind of advice would you give them? Oh, definitely. I I gotta come back again. I, yes. I'm really keen on, you know, trying mm -hmm. to maintain this and then come back and mm -hmm. even improve more. So um, whoever wants to, or thinks about coming, mm -hmm. uh, don't wait until second. I regret it 
uh, that I didn't actually book last year already when I heard the first time about it. And, okay. And I'm so glad I actually went. I wish I would have come early. That's my only regret, really. Yes. But um, yeah, I'm really glad I came and, and I can highly recommend it to everyone. Wonderful. I really hope people, you know, yeah. will make a session because it's changing your life. It's amazing. Okay, great. Absolutely amazing. I could cry now, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. really, it has had a huge, huge impact emotionally, mm -hmm. physically, mentally, in, in every way. So great. it's amazing. Okay, well, Miriam, thank you. It's been wonderful having you here. Thanks so thank much. You.